Uh, when did you start singing? I started singing as a, a small girl. Yes, you're still a small girl. Yeah, but uh -huh. when I was, like, let's say, smaller. How old? When I was five. Yeah, but five. I, I, I discovered that I can sing uh -huh. uh, when I was nine in church. Okay. Because at five, I just used to sing this kiddie songs like Baby Jesus. Mm -hmm. And I, at nine, I sang my first song called Son of Man you wrote in it? church. No, it's, it's actually not mine. Oh, you mean this? I know that Son of Man. Yes, is it Son a, of Man. It's a, what is it? Um, sing for me. I remember it. Son of Man, Son of Righteousness. I know it. Yeah, yeah, I love it. You Thank have such you. a nice soprano. Thank you. Okay, so then you sang Son of Man. Yes, mm -hmm. and then I was even given a prize. And for me, I didn't know that people liked my voice that much. Mm -hmm. But they ended up liking it. Okay. So since then, were you put in the praise and worship or what happened? I wasn't put. I was uh -huh. told by the pastor, uh -huh. by the bishop, people like this should not be singing. Be sitting at the back. Yes. They should be up here ministering to people. And then mm -hmm. I thought, and then my mom told me to join the choir, then I joined. Okay. Yes. So you joined the choir when you were nine? Yes. And now you're 13. Gosh, you have done so well for yourself at 13. <laughs> you don't want to know what I was doing at 13. No, dear. What are you doing? <laughs> I will tell you after this. <laughs> <laughs> so, how many songs have you done now? Uh, three. No, the ones that I've released are three, uh -huh. but the ones that I've done in total are eight. Okay. Yes. I remember seeing you on uh, Facebook. Mm -hmm. There was a video. Which song did you do that made people know you? It was going viral. Girl on Fire. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. I did that song back five months ago. Uh -huh. And uh, it went, to my surprise, it went viral. I, I Nothing like that ever crossed my mind. Uh -huh. Yes. You were just singing and someone was recording a video. Yeah, I, I, I was given candy and I didn't have anything else to give them in return. Yeah. Uh, I only had my voice. So I gave them what God had given me. It's the same thing with Christmas, mm -hmm. the gift, Jesus. But for me now, my gift was my voice. Mm -hmm. So I sang and ministered and I ended up becoming a, a celebrity. Yes, you're a star. <laughs> you are such a star. So who, write your, who writes your music? Mm, three of them, mm -hmm. which are Nipo, Sita Sahau, and one, and, and another one, mm -hmm. were written by Pitson. One was written by Vivian that's in love, and four were written by Chris Adwar. Okay, so you have, you said three and four. You have seven songs? No. You only have Those three. I've seen four, three online. Three uh -huh. Pitson. Uh, yes, three Pitson, one, one Vivian, four Chris Adwar. Those ah, okay. are eight. Okay. Yes. So have you? So you have people who write your songs. Yes. But do you know how to write a song? It's okay. I if tried. You don't. I tried. Right. Okay. I tried. Uh -huh. Back at home. Okay. Yeah. The the one that you wrote, did you sing it? Yeah. But not on YouTube because I haven't no. seen it. No. Okay. <laughs> practice. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Let's practice in the background. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> so I had people say that you're going to meet Alicia Keys. Did you meet her? No. Okay, because you sang her song, commented, yes? Mm -hmm. And I, I know I'm going to meet her one. She once. commented on your yes. she commented on your video. Yes. What did she, she say? Did, and she shared it. What did she, she say? She said, look at this soul, shine, 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 then smiley faces. Oh. Mm -hmm. And how did that feel? I, it felt I felt very important and, and very humbled and very pleased. Mm -hmm. Cause I had never met her. Uh, I had met two superstars before. Mm -hmm. That was Pitson and Vivian mm -hmm. and some more. Ruth Matete, Lucas. Mm -hmm. Lucas is my, he used to be in, in a competition called Kids Can Sing. Mm -hmm. He used to be my coach. Okay. Not my, but for the whole academy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And you're going to meet many more other people. I am. I want us to talk about your songs. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me about Sita Sahau. Sita Sahau is, an, is, is, is a song that like 20 years from now, I'll be listening to this song and I'll be remembering that I'll never forget these people who are always there for me, mm -hmm. praying for me, holding my hand, helping me when I need them, and supporting me. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's what Sita Sao is about. Yes. And how, how are you getting these collabs with big people? Mm -hmm. Tell me your secret. It, it, it just Vivian comes. Vivian and Pizza. How, did you, how did you get Vivian? Let's go step by step. So, mm -hmm. Vivian. Mm -hmm. How many years ago? Three years ago, we met mm -hmm. in, in a competition. But unfortunately, I didn't win. I was, I was position four. Vivian was the judge, mm -hmm. and 
from that time we never talked. Mm -hmm. Pitson, he, he was also somehow connected to that competition. competition uh -huh. We met, I talked to him, I sang. We actually just said hi, hi, that was it. I was so excited. I, I could not even talk because at that time he was a huge superstar. He was known everywhere like now he is. So I said hi, shaked his hand and then I went home. Mm -hmm. It was at the, at the finals. Yes. Okay. So then he looked for you to do a song with him later. Later on, mm -hmm. uh, and surprising, surprisingly, he was somehow connected to my label, then that signed me, Pine Creek. Okay. He was somehow connected. Used to say we used to write for them most of the songs. Okay. So he came, wrote for me this, this three songs. Then one of them called Nipoa. Mm -hmm. It was somehow a collaboration because it, it, it sounded very weird if he sang it alone. Ah, okay. So we had to sing it together and then... He needed your vocals or somebody's and he chose you to do the other part, yes? That's what you're saying. So, uh -huh. all those are my songs the that he writes. Okay, he sells okay, okay. them to me. Ah, okay. Yes. All right. So that's Pizza. Yes. And you said you met Vivian three years before that. Yes. So three years ago we didn't know you. Yes. That means she looked for you later or what happened? After going viral and all that, surprisingly, she had my mom's number. Okay. She called my mom, then came home, then took me, took me to the studio, then she started writing the song. Wow. Tell us about that song. In Love. Yes, In Love. It's an inspirational song. Mm -hmm. I'm living in love, meaning everyone, my surrounding, everyone who lives in me, are close to me, mm -hmm. and the person who lives in me, which is God, mm -hmm. they, are, they love me, they're always with me each step. Everywhere I go to, they're there with me. Mm -hmm. And he's given me everything that I need. Mm -hmm. My God. Mm -hmm. It's a mini Uwezo wake pia ni meukubali. Nangufu zake kwangu. Niza the money. Yeye ni mungu. So he's given me everything that I need. And for me, nikajua there is this God. And he he's mighty. Uwezo wake ni mku sana. And um... I really, I really, I, ha I have this urge to every day when I wake up, he's with me, mm -hmm. he's in me, mm -hmm. and he's always there to encourage me. Oh my goodness. Can you believe she's just 13? Like I'm sitting here looking at her thinking, okay, 13 year olds mm -hmm. are this smart nowadays. Where did we go to school or where did we go wrong? <laughs> you are so smart. Thank you. Yeah. Um, so I want you, you're going to sing us a Christmas song, yes? You know oh. next week is Christmas. Okay, yeah. See, so before you go, you have mm -hmm. to leave us with a Christmas song. Okay. But tell us about this new song now, that the one that you have done. Not in love and not uh, Sita Saha. Oh, Nipoa. Yes. So Nipoa, it's good to have a friend like Jesus. Because mm -hmm. imagine mm -hmm. you haven't paid tax. Mm -hmm. Then you go to your friend, Jesus, then he tells you, go open the mouth of a fish and you find money, go pay tax. He's always there for you. In in trouble, in happiness, never will he leave you. You know, earthly friends, friends whom we live with them in earth, they in the world, mm -hmm. they leave you, but mm -hmm. once you're prospering, they come back, mm -hmm. try to be friends. Once, once things go wrong, they go again. Yeah. So it, but for God, he's always there with you. Mm -hmm. He forgives you. And the Bible says, forgive Mara Sabini Nasaba. Because mm -hmm. there's no other way we can live. If if we were all like God, we would have prospered. Yeah. But then human beings are human beings. You we are so it. smart. Okay, me, I can listen to you the whole day. <laughs> <laughs>